Okay. Some progress. Um, the uh, CP55. Um, it's only a temporarily set up to stop. See if it's uh, running. Okay. The moment seems to be. I'm uh, not sure what up. Not sure what's up with uh, format free. I'll uh, get to that. Get into the manual and see what could it be. But I've only got the center channel um, hooked up at the moment. Um, going through on the uh, Marantz uh, 1030 down there, and I've got a JBL Control 5 on the floor over at the front. And I've got the projector one connected up. See the movement in there. Let's play that again. Take it up to seven. This is a Dolby 1960, 1976 classic. Format one works. Um, I haven't tested the uh, uh, sync yet. The levels have been um, a line, so that's the line. Um, there is a, a separate line level to adjust, and that's here and here. And there's a mono EQ here. I'm using an RTA. To the RTA so I can see the frequency curve. It's flat. I've tested the, uh, the terminals, um, I've only got a very uh, quick, simple attached to wires on the back. Tested the left, tested the right, tested the uh, surround. Both works. Um, but unfortunately, um, I haven't got much room over there to um, put the CP55 in, so I need another rack. Either um, I'll take out the CP500, um, got to move, move all this forward, move everything around, rack the uh, 55 in where the CP500 is. Um, but what do I use? The, what do I use it for? Um, um, I could use the. Uh, I could use the 55 for. Um, Logan 5, Francis 7, authorized duty quadrant. I could use it for, um, I don't know, just total vintage building stereo playback. Um, I mean, 
attaching the wires down uh, so it goes on to the um, uh, have to go through have to either have to patch it on to Yan the inputs for the left for the DCX left center and right um, surrounds oh, that's going to be a bit complicated because I've got to send the signal out to both both channels um, no, it shouldn't take too long to suss out um, oh but I'm not going to use it a lot hmm alternatively I could just rack it into the uh, rack and take the left center right out from the CP45 go through onto the auxiliary is it the auxiliary? no, um, no kinetic so auxiliary down at the bottom is labeled SR so I don't know what modifications has had done in the past or I don't know if this was rigged up with um, a Dolby SA5 which is possible I'm still still at a loss why format 3 is not running because that should be Dolby Stereo with no surround so that should be just left center right I assume but it's not running at the moment so it uh, doesn't look like there's anything wrong with the uh, printed circuit board here doesn't like nothing's been touched or anything um, unless it could be a loose wire and it down on the ribbon track I'll get to it. I'll get to it. Anyway, just I like the, uh, the the fader seems different. But I'll get to that. I'll get to that later. It's still early time. Anyway, what do you think, Sonny? Hey? Huh? Where? Where? You leave those wires alone, mate. Capricorn 15.